travel day can be exhausting. You've got to carry your suitcases and make every checkpoint through the airport. But there are unsung heroes out there that are carrying an extra bag with life in it from the island to give them a second chance. The Aruba airport is typically a busy place. At departures, it is generally filled with tourists traveling home after vacationing in Aruba. In a sea of passengers, there are also visitors of the island who are carrying an extra something for an incredibly good cause. The special helpers are known as animal rescue flight volunteers. Denise and Ron Butcher work closely with the Luna Foundation to transport puppies off the island. Winnie and Shelby are their 11th and 12th puppies they are taking back to their hometown of New England. One may think being a flight volunteer is a hassle and tedious, but according to these two very experienced transporters, it is a seamless process. The transition is very simple. Yeah. You, you become a flight volunteer, you fill out a simple application, they, if they have dogs that are under 20 pounds ready to go to some state, then they'll contact you. They meet you here at the airport. They make the arrangements with the airlines. All you do is take them through customs. You bring them to the terminal. You bring them on the plane with you. And then you get them to your destination. And they meet you. If we're not keeping the dogs, then the foster or the adoptive parents meet you right at baggage claim at your airport. And they take possession of their dog. A wonderful okay. experience for even us. I mean, every time we do it, it's... It's a great thing. It's the best day of your life to adopt a dog from Luna Foundation. You're going to get multiple years of happiness with that dog, and it's going to bring love and joy these, unconditional. These dogs have been to the vet yesterday or the day before. They're all checked out. They're all microchipped. Um, they've had their first shots. I mean, they're ready to go. Right. Bea Leba is Luna Foundation's volunteer for the butcher's trip. With any animal transport she handles, she will accompany the flight volunteers and puppies through the airport. Inside, she waits in line with Denise and Ron, plus Winnie and Shelby, until they get called to the airline counter. Volunteers from the foundation, such as Bea Leba, are present and available for any support the tourists traveling with the puppies may need, and they are there to answer any questions the airline agents may have. She is even along for the trip through customs. You'll notice Bea Leba is holding onto a Ziploc bag. This trusty bag is secured with everything the travelers will need for the pups on travel day. The original papers, a toy, there's a nylon bone to chew on it, a collar, a water bowl, some wipes, a pee pee pads, a garbage bag and gloves. So everything. Everything, everything that you need. Aruba is overwhelmed with dogs. Flight volunteers help immensely to alleviate the overpopulation. Every animal leaving the island goes to a home ready to care for a new pet. And if a home isn't secured yet, according to Ron and Denise, it takes a maximum of seven days in their hometown until a new family takes the dog in for good. For volunteers of animal foundations, taking the dogs to the airport and saying goodbye is a great feeling. It's good to help them. If you see them, when you pick them up out of, out of the bushes and they're terrified and now you bring them to the airport and they're happy, happy dogs. So that's good. Zoe is the founder of Luna Foundation. She says it is their job to prepare everything for the puppy departure from A to Z. So minimal effort is required from the rescue volunteers. To be a flight volunteer, people would think, oh, that's a hassle. It's not. All you got to do is sign up. Sign up and show up. We do everything. We make sure the paperwork is done. We pay the airline ticket. It costs you nothing but puppy snuggles. So you, we commit you at the airport. We walk with you to the counter. We walk with you till customs. You walk in with the puppy. You go through customs with it, which is also smooth. They just got to make sure the puppies are clean. They check their health certificate. And that's it. Your whole trip, you pull attention. You're like an attention magnet because the puppy draws attention. By them drawing attention, that's the flight volunteers' moment to promote the different foundation. It doesn't only have to be Luna. We have seven foundations on the island. Encourage people to go on any rescue page and sign up to be a flight volunteer. You save a life. It gives you a good feeling. Who doesn't love puppy snuggles? Ron and Denise are repeat visitors of Aruba. They've been coming to the island twice a year for six years. They do a lot more than transport the animals. Every time they vacation here, they roll up their sleeves and contribute to this one happy island. Rod and Denise have been with us for four plus years. They're now, they're not tourists for us anymore, they're family. 
in their vacation, they always come to our sanctuary and they work their butts off in the sun and they're filthy after, they help us clean. And when it's time to leave, they always take a puppy or two if we have them. We're forever grateful. They bring us supplies, bags full of supplies. So they know what we need, whether it's toys, collars, leashes, beds. They always ask, what do we need so that they can bring it to us? Like Zoe said, all you have to do is sign up and show up. Go to luna-aruba.com to fill in an application to become a flight volunteer or head over to their Facebook page to see what the foundation does year round.